Okay. Fruits of my effort. Long time effort of gathering stuff. I'm a hoarder. That's true. And we're about to start opening all of the stuff. Opening is fun. Always fun. Unless you get just tons of crappy stuff. It makes you very, very unhappy. We've got... Well, let's take a look what we've got here. We've got two dead men's chests. Ah, uh, very, very fresh. Hello, Matt Jules. Welcome. Uh, very, very fresh dead men's chest right here from the today's last known fleet location, Sunk Fleet Event. Um, am I supposed to actually hide some stuff? Um, we've got gold chests. Sadly, not not many of them. Uh, just just two gold chests. Uh, hey, Black Sails. Santa Cecilia is not a shallow ship, sadly. I've, I've tried. Doesn't sail in the shallows, sadly. Um, what else? We've got a bunch of mission chests. We've got a bunch of silver chests. In total, it's about 30 chests. More than 25. Maybe less than 30. I don't know how exactly. Uh, 27 to press us. Precise. How many seal bottles? 27. Oh, I've got 27 chests, 27 seal bottles. <laughs> so, let's get started uh, with the opening. We're gonna be moving our chests to the Christian's hold and opening them here so we can see exactly what we get. I just love fishing. <laughs> I'm always fishing when I'm PvPing, that's one of the, one of the rules in my streams. Always be. F okay, so here we go with the first one. What you get from mission chest? Usually just one or two things. They're not very good, but they're better than nothing. It's mostly about the silver chest, gold chest, and the other. Uh, that man's chest too. Silver chests are so so. They're not so great, but we'll see what we can get from them. First thing is reinforced masts. That's not bad. That that seems to be okay. Um, just. I'm not sure if I'm, how I have space for everything I get from these, okay. Mm, another mission chest. Okay, let's open it. Mm -hmm. Oh, Christian has behind chat and followers go. Okay, good point, good point. I'll, I'll move it over here. Thanks for letting me know. Um, I'm hiding the bottles. There's there's just so many people freaking out about them. Uh, next thing we get is basic grenades. Grenades five percent. The fire probability twenty five percent. And that's a lot. And the wine rations. Wine rations is a good thing. It's I like this upgrade. So uh, one of these uh, pretty good, uh, decent upgrades. I'm looking at the time on this dead man's chest. I've got five minutes till I need to open it. Five minutes, so we need to keep an eye on that because it has usually since the, since you looted, you have three hours on that. This one was looted later, so it's over one hour. This one I can open at the end of the street, uh, at the end of the opening of all of these. Uh, this one is supposed to be open soon in four minutes. Okay, continuing with the next mission chest. What is it? What is it? It is basic ladders. That's a crappy one. Never use this. Mm hmm Okay, next mission chest. Uh, <laughs> why would anyone watch this? I don't know, guys. I answer him in global. Why would anyone watch this? Uh, next mission chest. What was it swivels, probably. Uh, basic swivel guns, as I expected. Ah, uh, never use this one. Okay, another mission chest. Oh, it's Sea Musket 1766. Hell yeah. I mean, they've been nerfed like hell of a nerf. But still, these upgrades are gonna be good. Actually, after the you know the, the huge nerf today in today's hotfix, uh, they are they are actually a good upgrade. Not overpowered, not too weak, but good. I would say probably balanced, but I haven't tested them yet. Yeah, true. It's it's four percent or four. It's actually forty percent. Forty percent, not not four hundred. Okay, so it's it's balanced. 
keep an eye on this. Three minutes. Okay, three minutes more to go before opening that man's chest. Ah. <laughs> da, na koniec ta si radem se aż te pafiksli. Uh, next mission chest. What is it? Oh no, it's basic surgeon's chest. Oh well. Okay. Uh, okay, next mission chest. And uh, it is, it is. Ooh, another musket upgrade. Brown beast. Ah, uh, seems okay. It's It still has crew fire percent 10% and 25% of fire accuracy. I'm fine with that. It's not that bad. And an upgrade, and the musket upgrade is probably still decent, I guess. Even after the today's hotfix. Okay, uh, next mission chest. It, we're okay, okay, I see. So, what we've got is basic grenades just stacked with each other. You can see two of these. Hey, Spetsna, welcome to the stream. We still have uh, less than two minutes on that dead man's chest. So, okay. Let's continue. Mission chest, another one. And it's we've got our uh, reinforced mast. You can see there's two of them now. It's stuck with each other. Uh, see how it's one minute. Okay, so we need to hurry up. This mission chest is 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 oh another sea mask at 1760. Hell yeah. Okay, this one. What was it? What was it? Mm, that's another brown beast. There's now two of them. Okay, <laughs> we're, we're gonna open this one. There's like, let's not sit and watch the, how the clock goes down. Uh, so what we've got here, I think I've got the paint chest. Hey, Long John Silver, welcome to the stream. Uh, we've got Guacata Superior Gunpowder. I love that, I love that one. Uh, we've got rattlesnake node. I'm happy with this. Uh, Clash Royale opening chests. I actually play Clash Royale. It's a decent game. And this, this over here is a paint chest, everyone. That's my first paint chest since the wipe. I'm very excited about this one, but I'll keep it for later. Uh, this paint chest is gonna wait a bit. So we're gonna move that somewhere. Where's the where's the hold of Ah oh, okay it disappeared under that mm. Well where I can put on this side on the left side I guess So we've got a bunch of these upgrades we've got this one uh, it's, these windows are kinda clumsy twenty two thousand fur I had I had hundred and twenty thousand fur logs but I I've sent it to the clan warehouse. Uh, Trader's Brig, is that ship any good? <laughs> it, it's a good ship for trading. Uh, lost. Absolutely lost. Okay, let's continue following the opening. That's the last mission chest we've got now. And it's, it's another grenades. Ah. <sighs> Another grenade. Okay. No, I'm not gonna be complaining. We've got four musket mods. That's brown bees. Two mount two brown bees and two C muskets seventeen sixty six from mission chests, which are very common, easy to get. So I'm I'm fine with that. Hey Atomat, welcome to the stream. Uh but Tracebrick is the the biggest uh uh, trading ship that can sail through the shallows with, with the biggest hold. Eh, not many viewers, but they're gathering slowly. They're gathering slowly. 22 viewers, as I can see right now. Uh, what's in the clan room? Oh. Uh, a blueprint. Four people online in the clan room? Uh, okay. So we've got now silver chests over here. I'll probably start opening them in the trader's brick because 
to mix up stuff with this. Uh, hold on, guys, a second. What's your what's your view view on victory marks being removed from Admiralty? What can I say about that? Uh, well, just look at my upgrades. No, sorry, that's not this one. Not uh, I'm dummy. It's not upgrades. It's just oh, uh, what right? Oh, okay, it's the the the, the Lil Willy's secret stash. I have three hundred fifty victory marks because I've been in in lots of poor battles and I have. R really no reason to spend these victory marks that the the ships of the line are just expensive uh, uh no guys they, they are they're expensive so you don't really spend that many victory marks and you get them every week like three four or five Depending on how many poor battles you've been. I don't even know what's the price of the victory marks. Like, would anyone buy them from me? Uh, you know, I don't know, guys. Seriously, like, if someone wants to buy victory marks from me, send me a message. <laughs> I'm willing to sell most of them. Uh, our clan has much more of them just laying around. People say that why well, put help with the victory marks, but who knows? I don't think that why well, put help because. First rates are, but it's good that they're expensive. It's good. I like the, the 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 high cost of the first trades, but it doesn't make sense with the tons of victory marks just laying around. Uh, okay, let's start with the first silver chest. This is going to be probably much better stuff, much more things in there. Uh, so so let's check. First silver chest. It's a uh, British rig refit. That's good. And a reinforced sail, uh, reinforced sails. I don't think that's well. I don't know I I wouldn't really use that British regraph it. Actually, I feel like I've got better stuff from the from the mission chest. But that that's just the first one. Okay, let's let's continue with the others. Um, second one, second one. Extra shot. That's that's not bad. I mean, I I've never used these yet. I have like one or two of these. I haven't used them yet. But extra double shot one, which means I get like one more broadside of double shot, or or actually one more double shot per every gun on my ship. It is actually I think, which which is pretty a lot because we use lots of double double ball in battles. They are very good. They take more time to load, but they do so much damage, they're useful. Mm -hmm. I don't know, I need to try these on some on some ships first. Uh, let's see. Another silver chest. It is light carriages. Well, the light carriages... Um, you can use them as a ship knowledge on ships. I don't know if it's if it's a game feature or a bug. Same with the ram rations, extra ram ram rations. These are both books and permanent upgrades. I like to think overall. I'm not sure if I like it as a permanent, more or as, as a ship knowledge. Probably more as a ship knowledge. But so far, free chests, free silver chests. We didn't get anything crazy. Come on, give me some muskets. <laughs> give me the basic quadrant, improved sextant. That's all I'm waiting for. Another one. And that's another reinforced sail. Reinforced sails, actually. <laughs> Everyone's talking about sealed bottles, adding works. <laughs> guys, guys, focus on the, <laughs> on the chests. Uh, there's like... People are talking about these things, but no one's talking about mid grade nodes. I mean, I haven't shown the the tooltip text of that. Probably, people, probably no one recognizes by that by the icon. But how many people can recognize this by the name? 
mid grade note. No. I'll leave it as a riddle for you guys. Uh, let's continue with the, another silver chest. Oh, this one, this one, this one is lit shitting. Ah, you kidding me? Ah. And endurance, the, the ship's HP, negative 5%. Speed, 1.5%. It's. Crooked Hulu Refit is better than this. Why would anyone use that? Why would anyone use that upgrade? And it's from the silver chest. Seriously, like. So far, I've got much better stuff from the from the mission chest than silver chest. It doesn't make sense. But well, we got different stuff actually. But it seems like you know the the mission chest was giving better stuff. Ah, the next one. Oh, three things, and one of them is a speed upgrade. So first one to begin with, Bridgetown Frame Refit. That's okay. Could be useful, can be useful on on the poor battleships and for the for the patrol zones. If you want to make ships really tanky for PVE and so on, you just lose two percent speed and you get ten percent HP. Uh, what is this? This is the Bovenin Refit. I don't use that often, but it's good on traders and on PVP ships. If you don't have to, you know, too many speed mods, you can use that one. It's okay. And we've got basic quadrant. I'm quite happy with that. They're not uh, they're not so frequent to get. You don't see many of them around. Uh, I would love to get the improved sex done, of course. But I will take basic quadrant. You can stack that with the copper plating. Uh, the copper plating group that has three percent speed. This has three percent. Uh, it's half percent more than the navy hull. But I like that you can stack these things. So. We've got five more mission chest, uh, silver chests to go. We've got uh, two gold chests. We've got pain chest and a dead man's chest. Uh, I think I've went for over half of the chests, but the most interesting are still yet to wait on hold. Okay, let's go with that. Man, we've got improved mast tops. Ah, uh, I. It's actually not so bad upgrade to be honest. It it has the the dispersion ten percent reduced, but the firelock accuracy two percent. Like, look at this. Firelock percent ten percent. This two percent. Ten percent two percent. Well, it's it's actually closer numbers to each other. But I would love it to be maybe like 4%, 5%, 2% just seems to be so little. Uh, four more silver chests to go. What is this? What is this? This is Crook Tool Refit. And we've got uh, Late Shitting as well. One more. We've got two of these now. So, guys, just compare these two. Compare Crook Tool which gives 2% speed and you lose 5 HP, 5% endurance basically. Uh, and this where you use also 5% endurance, but you get only 1.5% speed. And of course you can stack these, these are cheap things, so you don't really care if you lose them, but crook tools are actually cheap upgrades. They're not expensive, so I think crooked hole refits are much easier to get than lit shittings. Like lit shittings drop from silver chests, not not even mission chests. They drop from the better chests. I don't know. Like seriously, by the look of it, mission chests just give better stuff. I didn't expect such results. Uh, well, besides the quadrant, three more, three more to go. Open another silver chest. Uh, something for boarding, that's boarding pike. 15% melee attack, 15% melee defense, disengage time, one round. Ah, that's, that's good. You can... Does anyone know if you can stack this with the boarding axis? Like, boarding axis give uh, disengage, disengage time too. So... It, two less rounds to disengage with the 
with the boarding access, this one gives one, so like, can you stack these two? I don't know, I, I want to check later if you can stack these. Uh, that will be interesting if you can actually reduce the disengage time by three rounds. Okay, next silver chest. And that's double hammax. Yep, I'm correct. Crew, 10% more morale. That's a huge strike for morale. Negative 20 morale. That's basically 20% less morale for you. So as this 100 is the base. Um, if anyone asks me if double hammocks are good, actually there's lots of people that hate double hammocks. I can answer that question. Hammocks are good on big ships. That 10%, like on a ship of the line, for example, first rate, that has 1100 crew, that, that's gonna be 110 more crew. So that can make a, make a big difference, actually. Uh, but would I use double hammocks for boarding ships? I probably wouldn't. And that's the last silver chest waiting over there. Come on, let's like give me give me the improved sexton. And what was it? It is Frederick Refi I'm f okay, that's not bad. I'm using Frederick Refits a lot. Well, I'm I'm not super super happy with the stuff I've got from silver chests. Pico's asking if the Trace Brick is better than the Trace Links for solo trading. Well, Trace Brick is more efficient and can carry much more stuff in the hold. But the Trace Links is a much safer option, much faster option as well. Uh, so you, ha you have to choose between safety and between efficiency. You're welcome, always happy to answer all of the questions. Unless there's just so many of them that I just miss. Uh, okay, now we've got gold chests, and I really don't want to be disappointed with the gold chests. Let's let's hide this for now. Let's uh, let's open let's open a hold of uh, I don't know what we've got. A hold of a Bologna. No, it's almost full. Mm. Oh, Molder's online. Uh, where, where are we gonna open? I guess we can open them here in this trace brick. Sure, feel free to ask questions. So. Okay, gold chest. Nah, we're gonna open that in the rattlesnake, I guess. We don't wanna mix up stuff. There's just so many of these things. Okay, rattlesnake. Okay, gold chest, bun two of them uh, don't you think that five tunas are, are a Christian war <laughs> oh god oh. <laughs> people come on gold chest sadly I just have two of them but that that needs to be good and Spanish graphite extra grog. Someone needs to buff silver and gold chests. I'm just making tiny suggestion. Okay, another gold chest. And and then oof, that's that's lots of stuff. That that's that's a lot of stuff. I don't see improved sex stunt, so I'm not not super super happy. But let's check that. Uh, French Rick, that's okay. This is Pavel Note, so it actually gives me a ruddy ship. I I can choose the woods. Uh that's also okay. I mean, I I I. I don't use Pavels a lot. I'm not a big fan of them, especially since we've got Christians. We've got, we've got so many Christians. Everyone has three Christians, but I don't know. I, I'll probably use it for like a patrol zone or something. Uh, this is Service History de la Marine. Ooh, that that's the book you use for making Elite French Rick Refit. Uh, 
So I'll keep that. I'm happy about that. What is this? <laughs> is someone trolling me? Book of Five Rings Blueprint. <laughs> I'm just gonna send it to the chat. And after that, I'm gonna send. Uh, it's actually great, Yvonne Dick. Where's, where's Salt? <laughs> We've got 144 Salt. <sighs> someone, someone killed me. <laughs> uh, it was, it was chain rations. Okay, this one's good. It gives you extra chain two, so that's like extra two chain per every gun. If I if 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 I'm not mistaken. Uh if if oh okay. Okay, we're opening the last dead man's chest we've got fifty six minutes and it's on a rush, but <laughs> I'm not gonna wait fifty six minutes of course. Uh hey Reiji, hey hey, welcome to the stream. Uh, we're gonna open it here. If someone wonders, the weight of the dead man's chest is 1500, super heavy, so you need at least Trader's Brick to carry it. Let's see what good stuff we've got inside. Mm, I don't see any pain chests. British Gunnery Surgeon, that's good. Santisma Permit, that's crap. The water boot, that's okay. And Santissima note, hell yeah, I'll I'll take that. <laughs> Havoc have sunk quite a couple of my Santissimas, so that'll be good to replace my lost Santis. I love Santis, everyone knows that. But well, I I've, I've got these water boots all over the place. Yeah, a Santi note. That's <laughs> that's a good replacement. We even have two water books in the clan. I don't know why. It's just it's just so many water books everywhere. No, that was a dead man's chest. That was the dead man's chest. Very fresh, right from the today's last known fleet location. <laughs> yeah. So. Stunty node, I'm happy about that. That's that's a good thing to get. Uh yeah, I've I've found two found two of the dead man's chests over there. So I guess No, it's not yours, Reggie, it's not yours. I guess now it's time for a chest that everyone's waiting for. The the paint chest. Ew, it would be would be shame if I click the destroy button. What was the description of that? It says, well, it just says item can be opened only in port. Okay. Doesn't say anything fancy. I would, I would add some fancy description to that. Ah. <sighs> what is it gonna be, guys? Pink Royal, Cerberus Carota. I, I just hope for a breast harbor or well for some I don't know. I want this I want a Bellona paint. Santi paint. Santi or Bellona paint. That's right. Either Santi or Bellona. Uh, okay. We're hoping for the best. I be sure. I'm sure my decision. Well, it's over there next to my Dublin stocks. Please don't be don't be Cerberus paint. <laughs> oh man! I, I mean, I'm 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 not angry. I'm not sad. But I actually do have a Niagara. We've got the Niagara Rock Noir. Permanent upgrade lost when durability is lost. I think I'm going to equip it right away on my Niagara. Just need to find it. Where, where, where is it? Where, where's my Niagara? Oh, it's in Latter 2. Perfect. 
I can just uh, wait. I I probably have a fleet ship assigned. Let me check. Uh, yeah, I've got Christian as a fleet. Sent to dogs. I be sure. I be sure. I oh, see, guys. The the part localization changed the teleport into transport because people usually did not teleport during the age of sail, right? We're just transporting between outposts. We're slowly working on the part localization for naval action, also improving the the overall language, correcting the mistakes. Uh, so we've got the purple Niagara over here. We're gonna jump on it right now. And we're gonna sail over to Port de Pa. <laughs> It'll be like, it was, is it repair warning? You don't have any repairs, matey. Okay, thank you, thank you for letting me know. I mean, I don't expect to be jammed by anyone, but Let's, let, let's just, for safety measures, let's equip repairs. Uh, 40 hull, 40 rig, and like, what, 150 ram, I guess. It's gonna be okay. It's fine. It's like, what, gonna be now 50 people outside ladder 2? Where's, where's my ram? Ram, 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 ram. Am I, am I, oh, it's over here, okay. So many upgrades, god damn it. I, what did I do to green so many chests? I enslaved half of my clan and I told them to work hard for all of these chests. <laughs> sort my warehouse, oh my god, I would just totally fuck up everything. It's 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 in beautiful Ordnung, a, in a it's basically Prussian Ordnung. Everything's sorted so nicely. Wow, ladder two is empty. No one's trying to stream stack me. No one's, no one's watching. Or is it just, is it just a silence before the storm is? Uh, there's, there's no one undocking. So it's all fine. It's quiet. Oh, is that uh, just it's the, the Prussian reinforcement fleet? We're basically in, in the in the Prussian reinforcement area. I just don't know about that. Okay, <laughs> I've received two experience for my travel. Thank you. That's that's really helpful. Uh, how how? Okay, that's E. Okay. Um, over here, Niagara Rock Noir Pain. We're dropping that on the ship. And let's take a look. Ooh. <laughs> Secret. This looks sexy. I mean, the ship is small, that's true, but it makes the Niagara look very, very sexy. It's, uh, if you want to have a better look, we need to actually undock. It's like the Batmobile of ships. <laughs> Oh man, you guys are any British player? Who's that? It's a, that's a Hercules. Someone sent like 50 ships after that Hercules. A good Hercules is a sunk Hercules. Okay, let's take a closer look at this paint. It's uh, no enemies around, or are there enemies? No enemies, okay can hide the UI and let's take a closer look at this pain. It's a beautiful name on the stern. Oh, these goddamn crazy big coronates. Why am I going? Is my ship sinking or something? 
Okay, speed up a bit, speed up. Well, Niagara is just so low in the water, it looks like it's sinking almost. I was hoping for a Santisma or a Bologna paint, but I'm not complaining. That's the first painted ship I've got. Uh, besides, besides Endymion's and besides Bologna's, the white paints you've got. I'm not thinking if the center is painted, like nothing changed in the center of the ship. Or maybe these things look more light. But you know, the sides, they all changed. You've got green, red colors over here on the center and nice and brown on the sides. What do you guys think about that paint? It's my, it's my poor bottle Niagara. Rage doesn't like it. 